What is going on guys? Welcome back. Bringing you a brand new game on the channel today. This game came out about a week ago. I've already played a good amount of the game. Um, this is going to be more the end, actually, of like the campaign story mode. So if you guys don't want any spoilers, if you plan on playing Ghost Recon, it's a really fun game. I do suggest getting the game if you aren't sure about getting it. Um, I mean, I'm sure, like, you're probably going to figure out, like, the goal. I mean, if you play the game, you're going to understand, like, what the end goal is. So it's not going to be much of a spoiler. You're going to kind of know how it ends. Um, you're going to have to defeat them, basically, which is mainly killing them. I'm not sure how it exactly ends. I don't know if you kill him, if you, whatever, how you do it. Um, I'm talking about the cartel boss. This is a, like, drug organization that you're part of a, like, covert army ranger this is your squad here, and your goal is to basically take down the cartel. Let me show you guys. I'll just do a quick little intro to the game, because um, we are pretty far along. Um, in my particular, my controller's lagging. So hold Come on. All right, we lagged out. No big deal. We're back now. We had to restart the game. So basically, I just wanted to show you some of the aspects of the game, if you were looking into it, if you wanted to get it, and also just because it's the first time that it's on my channel, so I just wanted to, you know, try to explain it a little bit. So basically here, you're going to have, like, all your skill upgrades. You have a drone in this game where you can kind of throw it up and really kind of use it as a support drone and just kind of spot people, help you like that. Physical, pretty self-explanatory, helps your character in certain things, like this, for example. The ground vehicles, you take take less damage, stuff like that. Your weapon, um, stable aim, better, like, sniper accuracy, Grenade launcher, more ammo capacity. Like I said, pretty self-explanatory stuff here. So if you get the game, you want to look at it, just check that out. And then this is your loadout where you can get, you find different guns on the map. You can't, you don't really unlock them per se, but you just kind of find them. Um, I do have a new weapon now. Let me try this. All right, there we go. I, I didn't really want to change. I just wanted to get the new off there. I always not like that. But I'm using the P416. That's like the first gun you get, but I, I got like an extended mag on it now which is 50 rounds of clip, so it's a lot better than the start where you start with like 20. But that's no big deal. Um, I'm level 22 in this game. You start level 1, and it takes a good amount of time to rank up each time, but 22 is like probably pretty high for someone right now in this game. Um, my Rebel Presence, my Rebel Force Presence is um, 9 out of 45. So that's, it starts at 1 out of 45, so you grow Rebel Forces, and they help you throughout the game. Um, and then you have the Santa Blanca, Santa Blanca Cartel that's headed by El Swing. I'll show you a map in a second that kind of shows like, you like what you're supposed to do in the game and stuff like that. And we have currently destabilized 59% of the cartel. So they're kind of I've already killed a couple of their top players. I've kidnapped a couple of them, kind of like turned them against each other. Um, and we'll actually be meeting. I, I'm on, I want to make this video today because we're actually meeting with the head of the cartel in like five minutes um maybe less depending on how i cut the video <laughs> um and then the unit forces they're a military they're part of the bolivian army this all takes place in bolivia and south america if you didn't know and um they're the the cartel is basically supplying cocaine to south america mexico united states and canada basically everywhere um on this side of the oceans and, yeah, so basically we're trying to stop them from the U.S. because we also have a big um, problem with cocaine in the U.S. It's not like a big problem. We don't have people running around, but you know what I mean. So people are doing cocaine. People are dying. People are going to jail. So we're trying to cut them at the source. And they're also just to help out the Bolivian people is really, like, the main reason why that we're here currently. And a uh, American DEA officer was killed at the beginning. If you get the game, they'll um, kind of go over that a little bit. But, um, all right, so let's move on a little bit. I'll show you this map here. Basically, this is the map of people you want to try to... A lot of these people you kill, a lot of them you capture. It's like, I'm not going to tell you exactly, because if you're going to play the game yourself, I don't want to ruin it for you. Um, but a lot of them end up not being as bad as they might actually seem. And stuff like that. It's, a, it's not always as like, oh, go kill them, go kill them. It's it's not, they did a good job with the story, so it's not that boring, per se. Um, We do have a mission to hunt down El Moro now. He's the head of security. So I think once you get two heads, then you can finally go after Sueño. So um, as you can see, Sueño is not locked anymore because I do have a mission. 
for him. So I think we're going to go check it out. Um, he's a really bad dude. He has a There was a cutscene earlier in the game. Um, also, just side note real quick. This map is absolutely huge. Honestly, the biggest biggest game I've ever played um, by far. Um, so we have a mat. We have a, not a match. We have a mission up here to, it says, Swing, you put the word out. He wants to negotiate. Though it's possible we've heard him so much that he wants to talk peace. It's more likely he's planning an ambush. Two can play at that game. Go to the meet. If Swingo turns up, kill him. So that's the goal right now. If he um, meets, I don't think he will be there. But if he is, we will kill him. Maybe he wants to negotiate. Maybe he wants to kill you. Either way, let's listen in. Watch your ass. All right, the woman talking right there is she's a CIA officer, and she is a um, part of your like she's basically just like your intel in here. So that's basically what she's doing. And I'm just going to cut until we get there, so I'll, I'll meet you guys there. So we're driving down the mountains here in this little t village, I guess. I was going to say it's a town. I, I don't know. Is it a village or a town? Uh, I think we're going to go hop in one of these choppers. I might hit this intel up. There's always intel um, throughout the cities, throughout everywhere, really. but um, Or information. It's not necessarily intel. And you, you either like talk to somebody or you can just take pictures of a little piece of paper like this. So we're going to go ahead and investigate this. I'm going to try to show you every, like a little bit of everything, not just the main story. So we can kind of get everything done, per se. Let's go um, you can run pretty far in this. This is like a little side mission. We're going to kind of ignore that because... Dude, are you serious? I got hit by a car, and I'm down. I wanted to try to find a little bit of action so I could um, start shooting. You get Your teammates can revive you. If you actually start a mission, um, you'll get one down, and then you, you'll die after that, and you'll have to restart. There's no checkpoints in this game, but you do get two lives, so that's good. Um, And also, I just wanted to point out that there should be a little music playing. We do have enemy forces in this area, so let me, before I go on with that... Um, if you ever see these red, it'd be either red or purple. Red is the cartel, purple is the army, but they've, um, they're not really the army. Um, they've accepted money, they've killed people, they're innocent people. They're basically working with the cartel, and they're just fine with it because they give them a lot of money. Another thing you can do in this game is you can sink shot. Let me try to... So basically what that means is I can just hit X on this dude... And then if my team, one of my teammates sees him, I can hit fire, and it'll kill him. Um, but I can't do it yet because it's not synced because he can't actually spot him right now. Because he's inside, so it makes sense. So um, I'm just going to move in, actually, and knock this guy out. This is a very stealth game. Kind of spotted that guy. You can tag him when you see him. So you always want to do that. And then I'll just pop that dude in the chest into him. I think there's a dude over here. Um, Alright, we're going to move up a little bit. Um, hopefully that music doesn't matter. It wasn't supposed to play, I didn't think. But I think last... I'm trying to make one more video on this um, a couple weeks ago. Or like a few days ago. And it wouldn't let me upload it because it was copyrighted. I was pretty pissed. And I just turned the... The volume all the way down. Let me check that again. Because I just turned volume all the way down for um, audio, music. See? And it's still playing it. So, I mean, that must not be copyrighted then. I think that's just game audio. Alright, we're just going to head over here. Um, This game definitely looks pretty cool, though. So, the mission right now is we're going to go meet with El Sueño, the head of the cartel. This is basically the entire game. Like, I've played a good amount on this game. And the entire game, it builds up to, like, eventually trying to kill Sueno because you know he's the criminal mastermind, so to speak, behind this whole thing. It's, he's killed literally thousands and thousands of people. Um, so he's the horrible person, horrible guy. And he's, like, in like ruined all these people's lives that live in Bolivia because now, like, they're just constantly frightened, terrified because there's cartel members, like, harassing them constantly because... I mean, obviously, they want to make money. That's really the only thing they care about. So, um, you know, we're trying to we're trying to help these people free up their territory. Um, 
we're in a new province right now. That's why you see these question marks on the map. Um, I still haven't explored a good amount of the map. So. Alright, looks like um, it's going to be on the other side of this hill here. The choppers in this game are kind of difficult to fly. Um, I don't know. They're not too difficult. But sometimes it just... I don't know. We're hunted right now. It's not good. I think I'm going to dip out of my chopper. Right here. I'm just going to parachute down with my squad. Don't worry. They, they know how to do it too. And your squad just kind of like spawns up wherever you go. Because, you know, it's just kind of... CPU controlled. So we're going to land over here. And we're going to try to scout the land. I think I'm just going to do this mission in the gameplay. Hopefully we get a good amount of action. I don't know if we will though. But um, I'll definitely do another video coming soon. I'll probably go after Muro, who will be the um, head of security. So I'm sure that'll be a, t a tough fight. Hopefully I can pull off some nice shots and stuff. Keep your eyes open. We're going to send out the drone here. Alright, looks like a phone's ringing down there. And I don't see, nobody's on the map, so that means nobody's here. So we're gonna head down and see what's going on. It could be an ambush. They could spawn up late. But we'll see. Alright, let's listen in here and see what Swing Yu has to say. Alright, there's the phone. Fuck. <laughs> yeah. This is El Sueño. It is a pleasure to finally speak with you. Here I thought we were going to meet face to face. Don't tell me you're running late. I apologize for the subterfuge. But people in our line of work, we must be cautious. But I am not a liar. There are no Sicarios in your area. No Unidad. I only wish to talk. Tell us where you are. Then we'll talk. I am only attempting to end the bloodshed. There is no need for it. It's bad for my business. And it is bad for Bolivia. This country has been trying to get back on its feet for decades. Do not kick it back down. Says the guy who turned this country into his own personal glory hole. You got something of value to say? There are four cars in front of you. Consider them a signing bonus. You better say that again. Must be something wrong with my hearing. You want to hire us? You're four of the most dangerous people alive. Of course I want to hire you. Every day you risk your life for your country. And your government pays you casi nada. Put those skills to work for me, for Santa Blanca, and you will make more money than you can imagine. Sorry, but we're gonna have to politely ask you to go fuck yourself. See, we only came to this meeting to kill you. The fact that you aren't here just means you get a little more time on this earth. But I figure you should start saying your goodbyes, because we're coming for you. And we're gonna burn you down. So be it. I will enjoy watching you try. All right. Well, that didn't go as planned, but pretty lucrative job offer. Job offer. Did you take it? Benefits package wasn't great. We told him we were going to kill him. So you stuck with us for now. Fair enough. Just be in touch. I'll take my car though, let's be honest. I mean, we can still take him. Um, I don't know. It looks dark on the screen. Hopefully it's not that dark, and if it is, my fault. Um, but yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed the introduction. Maybe we'll go um, swing by another group and try to just do some fighting real quick. I don't know. Um, actually, you know what? That'll just be the introduction to the game. We're going to probably hit up El Moro here in the next video. Hopefully you guys stick around. Come check it out. The game's pretty fun. I think you guys will enjoy it. Um, this is the first video I'm going to upload on this game, so definitely definitely come check it out. We're going to be fighting El Moro, and then we're probably going to go after Sueño again and actually kill him and some more stuff. I mean, I've already done a, good, a lot of missions on this game, taking down some other guys, as you can see here. It's all this stuff I've already done, but we still have a good amount of stuff that we haven't done. So all these provinces over here I haven't even been to. This one down here, this one down here, and this one over here. So we still have... You know, probably a, a good, um, we could probably do another, like, six, eight videos in this game if you guys wanted to check them out. So, leave a like on the video if you did enjoy it. And, um, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed. Leave a like. Thanks for watching, guys. Subscribe. Talk to you guys later. Peace.